Conditions here are basic. There is poor sanitation, few options for health care, and few jobs. But it is free of one thing that prompted many to move here discrimination. <laughs> Leprosy today is a treatable disease, but in Vietnam, there are still at least 60,000 people who live with leprosy. Many are concentrated here in Vietnam's central highlands. Even though times have changed, discrimination against leprosy patients can be severe, according to relief workers. Người dân tộc rất kỳ thị người bệnh nhân cùi. Khi họ lành bệnh rồi, thì họ không cũng không được về. Sister Pham Thi Ngoc Hoa works closely with leprosy communities in the area. She said the old fears of leprosy still linger. Leprosy is a disease that often affects the poorest of the poor. Marginalized communities with poor sanitation and limited access to health care. The Central Highlands is one of Vietnam's poorest regions, and this poverty is often at its most severe in indigenous communities. <laughs> Treatment and support for leprosy is available through the government as well as aid groups including Catholic organizations. In communities like this one, the government has provided basic infrastructure, but life remains a daily challenge. Despite the difficulties, there is hope for the future. Discrimination lingers, but it is improving. Still, most residents of this leprosy community say they have no plans to leave. Jui has lived with leprosy since he was a child. For years, he lived by himself, shunned by people in his village. He has a family here now, but he's afraid the same prejudices remain at his old home. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.